The Mr. Excel Podcast is sponsored by Easy Excel. Learn Excel from Mr. Excel Podcast, episode 1875, Launch Rockets with Excel, Rapid Prototyping. Hey, welcome back to the Mr. Excel Netcast. I'm Bill Jelen. Well, that's my picture right there at Kennedy Space Center. And thanks to the NASA social program, I was chosen, along with these other 37 of my new friends, uh, to watch a launch at Kennedy Space Center. NASA social is a great program if you are at all interested in science or space, uh, check them out. They have new programs all the time. And while the launch was postponed during the weekend, we got to see all kinds of great things uh, behind the scenes, things that people would never get to see, even if you go on the tours, the insider tours at uh, the Kennedy Space Center. So it was an amazing opportunity. And they do show off some of the new technology. This is the robot astronaut. His legs are going up on the next space, SpaceX launch. Or these small satellites that are actually have a cell phone inside. And they're like six inches small. And they're, they're launching those. Uh, and at one point, uh, one of the first things we did when I was taking this very seriously, I'm here as a social media person. Uh, this is Stephen Cox, who runs the firing rooms. And people were asking Stephen all kinds of rockety questions like these that measures filth mills lightning is not a great thing when you're launching rockets and so being mr excel what did i ask steven i said hey do you use excel here and at first mentioned some budget things but he said you know we did do something really interesting with excel steven used excel's drawing tools to mock up a system here it is in his words and while he's talking I'm going to try and do the same thing in Excel. One of the real cool things I did in Excel was I had to simulate a, a program that we're going to use out here. And so in order to help the engineers understand what I did, I made like 30 different pictures in Excel. Uh, Using what the, the console would look like. like and a hyperlink tools. to jump between uh, them so that... Uh, nice. Hyperlinks to jump between pages and it actually looked function form function exactly like the prototype I mean that they built after that. But the cool thing was that the engineers walked in, I just showed it to them and said build this. And so that was a prototype of uh, things like Excel. It's an easy tool that people know how to use. Right. And I turned out a, a prototype, a rough prototype of a system that we've been using over there for eight years now. That's crazy. And, uh, and, and the prototype it, it did, I did it in a couple of hours. That's, that's wild. And the system was for? Well, we had something called a consolidated console. And the idea is that we were taking what we up here, we did eight years ago, bring in different platforms and post them on one. And so I drew, you know, our video, how we commanded our video on one and how we commanded our data system on another one and how we did our voice system. And I made just box diagrams. Right. And then you'd have a button and you press a button, it would go from red to green. Well, it jumped to a page that had it green. Oh, yeah. And then it would go back to yellow if you hit it again. Sweet. And it would jump to another page and say, here's our video page. And then here's how you would select video. And, and it jumped between these pages. Now, if you look at the bottom, you had like 30 pages open. But it was instantaneously, and it worked exact functions as a GUI interface, just like we needed to work. So that mock-up then is what they used to I build the real thing. I just gave it to him and said, make it look like this, and he turned it into code. Cool. It's not your it's not your typical use it's not your typical use for uh, Excel. It's funny there's so many non-typical uses. I hear all kinds of things that people do. But that hyperlink all I used oh. in there was that hyperlink function. Yeah, from the drawing object spray. Right. right in. Yeah, yeah beautiful. Thank you. That's good. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Hey, so isn't that a cool use for Excel? You have to uh, you know, drop some specs and someone's going to program that uh, by having all these different sheets down. And then by having these hyperlinks, it goes from one sheet to the next, and it shows the functionality. Isn't that cool? Now, Steven works at Kennedy Space Center. That system that he designed was used to launch rockets. Isn't that an amazing use of Excel? And again, I want to point you to NASA Social if you are at all geeky. And obviously, if you're watching this, you are uh, just a, a great opportunity for behind the scenes. And it's not just in Florida. They have them at, at various NASA sites around the country. Check it out. Watch for an upcoming one and apply. I highly, highly recommend it. Well, hey, for more uh, pictures and links from that uh, NASA Social weekend, check out the YouTube comments right down there below this video. I want to thank Stephen Cox for that great idea, and I want to thank you for stopping by. We'll see you next time for another netcast from Mr. Excel.